Hi everybody! Today we are going to study good derivatives. As you remember from yesterday, there are two different groups in wood derivatives. Engineered wood that we have already studied and cellulose materials. And today we will study about these materials, cellulose materials. The main property of cellulose materials is that they are made from the cellulose of wood. In our daily life, there are many things made of this type of materials. Do you recognize, for example, the cardboard, el cartón, card, cartulina, tissue paper, el papel de seda, and paper? What is the main material in this group? Obviously, the paper. So, let's study the process of obtaining paper. This is the whole process from the forest where we have the trees, logging, stripping the bark, grinding the wood, washing and bleaching, and at the end we obtain the rolls of paper. So let's see one by one the different steps. Step. We have the trees in the forest, so the wood has to be shredded. We cut down the trees, the bark, that is removing the bark, and after that the wood is ready to obtain the cellulose. So we have to remove the rest of substances that the wood has and we want only the cellulose. So the wood, it is mixed with water and chemical products in order to be transformed in cellulose paste in this container called digester. So lignin and other substances are eliminated through chemical treatment. So now we have here the cellulose paste, only cellulose, because we have removed the rest of the substances. Next step, washing and bleaching of the cellulose paste. The cellulose paste undergoes a process of washing and bleaching. Tenemos la pasta de celulosa y en estos contenedores la vamos lavando y blanqueando. Antiguamente se hacía con lejía. De ahí el nombre de bleaching, bleach es lejía, y actualmente se hace con oxígeno. Next step. We need to remove the water. So, the excited water is eliminated through succion or aspiration. So, we have the liquid paste. And we need to remove the water by succion or aspiration of the water content. Tenemos un exceso de agua, así que necesitamos retirarle el exceso de agua a la pasta de celulosa, que ya está blanca, pero queremos que sea muchísimo más densa para poder convertirla en el papel final. Next step. The resulting paste is pressed and laminated into a machine until it becomes a paper sheet. Pressing the paste with rolls, presionando con rodillos, que cada vez consiguen una lámina más fina. Drying, 
and smoothing rolls are employed for this process. Mm -hmm. Drying the paste with heated rolls and smoothing with rolls. And the final step is the sheets are winded up and cut. Winding and cutting. Bobinamos la lámina resultante en bobinas gigantes. Estas bobinas pueden tener de diámetro más de 2 metros. Y finalmente las cortamos. Thank you very much for your attention. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow in class.